The Battle of Glenlivet was fought on 3 October 1594 between the forces of George Gordon, 1st Marquess of Huntley and Francis Hay, 9th Earl of Errol, who were Catholics, and the Protestant forces of Archibald Campbell, 7th Earl of Argyle. The battle took place in the Glen of Glenlivet in Scotland, and was a result of the ongoing tensions and struggles between Presbyterians and Catholics in the country, as well as the complex political relationships between Catholic and Protestant powers in Europe at the time. The battle was significant as it was the first time artillery was used in the highlands of Scotland, and it also highlights the Kirk's efforts to eliminate the Catholic faith from Scotland. The Earl of Argyll and the Earl of Athol were commissioned by the King to deal with traitorous Jesuits returned from abroad accompanied with strangers and supplied with money to stir up public weir and they launched a campaign against Huntley and other rebel lords and their clan allies. The two sides encountered each other on a hillside near Ben Rins, where Huntley had laid an ambush for Argyll as he climbed the hill. Huntley used his cavalry effectively in the confined space of the pass and completely routed Argyle's troops. Rather than risk going into battle against the king, Huntley submitted to his mercy and went into temporary exile. The clans involved in the Battle of Glenlivet included the Gordons, Hayes, and Campbells. The Gordons were led by the Catholic George Gordon, 1st Marquess of Huntley, and the Hayes were led by the Catholic Francis Hay. 9th Earl of Errol. The Campbells were led by the Protestant Archibald Campbell, 7th Earl of Argyll. The Mackintoshes, Grants, and Forbes were also involved in the battle, with the Mackintoshes and Grants supporting Huntley and the Forbes, supporting Argyll. The battle was fought between these clans and their respective allies, with the Gordons, Hayes, and their allies ultimately emerging as the victors.